Hi guys, I'm Andy and welcome back to Backpacking UK. Today I'll be reviewing my Osprey Talon 22 rucksack. It's a great multi-purpose rucksack this one. Perfect for walking, hiking and cycling. So what I'll do, I'll tell you a little bit about this rucksack first and then I'll try it on so you can see how it fits. This Talon 22 is a 22 litre rucksack, but it's actually quite big. It's 51 centimetres from top to bottom. This medium to large rucksack is 28 centimetres from side to side and also 28 centimetres from front to back. So it's actually quite a bit bigger than the small to medium version. Uh, just so you know, I'm 5 foot 8, 172 centimetres. Um, despite my size, I did actually need the medium large version. So it's well worth considering uh, if you're thinking about buying one of these. Um, it's got lots of features, but by far the number one feature, and that's really what you're paying for, is this airscape back. So it's a fully ventilated back from top to bottom and also right to the sides too. Um, not only is it fully ventilated, so it's excellent in summer, um, it's also super comfy, so comfortable this rucksack. Um, I really, really like uh, the side pockets on this rucksack. I use side pockets quite a lot, um, just for like snacks and energy bars, uh, to be honest. Um, it's got a big compartment for a bladder. I've got a two and a half litre reservoir to go in here. Um, I should note that it doesn't come with a reservoir. Um, it's just got a little loop at the top so you can hang it up. Um, the straps, it's got some adjustments here. Um, on the front, it's got a really useful stash pocket for waterproof. It's got some little drain holes too. A little device here, which is actually for a cycling helmet. Um, so you can actually secure your cycling helmet on here. Uh, at the top here, you've got quite a nice top pocket. I use it for my sunglasses. Um, really useful it's a nice soft pocket now with this osprey rucksack it's just got one main pocket within the main pocket it's got a little mesh pocket with a zip and just with a little key attachment here so i know some rucksacks have sort of two main pockets but this has just got just got one and then also on here um you've got two water bottle side pockets which are adjustable too. And then you've also got trekking pole attachment down here. Um, you've got another sort of attachment here and here too for things like an ice axe, if, if that's your thing. Um, but it's a really nice uh, rucksack, really well made. The back's lovely. It weighs 810 grams, um, which is super light really. Um, now, this retails at £120, right, £120. I've had to buy a reservoir for it and I bought a waterproof cover for it. So that's, that's £150 all in. That's a huge amount of money, um, enormous amount of money. And for that reason, I, there's no way I can say a 22 litre rucksack that costs £150, there's no, it's just... I can't say it's good value for money. If you've got the money, if you've got the money, I would say, yeah, it's a fantastic rucksack. If you've got the money, go and buy one. And I think they've just released a brand new version of this too. Um, if you're somewhere in the middle, I'll try and get this rucksack in the sale. Now I've seen it in the sale um, for down to sort of 70 quid. Now 70 quid's much more like it. If you get it for that money, I'd go for it. Um, but certainly, there's lots of cheaper options out there. They're nearly as good as this. So for me, it's a it's really nice rucksack, but there's no way I can say go out and buy one. It's just not like that. Um, so anyway, let's see what it looks on. Okay, let's try on this Osprey Talon 22 litre rucksack. Just slips on little clip at the top like i say we've got really nice sides here they're really supportive so you can 
load this rucksack up and you'll be comfy all day. Slightly bigger clip at the bottom, it's fully adjustable, it's just a really, really nice fit. Like I say, this is a medium large version, your pockets on the side, got a stash pocket you can just reach out of in the rear. It's a great rucksack. Like I say, if you've got the money, I would seriously think about buying a brand new version of this. If you've got a little bit less money, try and get this one in the sale. But if you just don't have that much money or your budget doesn't allow for it, don't feel like you're really missing out. There's lots of cheaper options out there that are fantastic. So hopefully you've liked this review. Please give us a like, definitely subscribe. I've got lots and lots of videos out there at the moment and even more coming. And hopefully I'll see you soon. Cheers.